So, I have not played this game in a very, very long time. Please have audio. Excellent, it has audio. <laughs> I was worried. But this doesn't have a title theme. Anyway, this is the OG Mega Man, so... Often referred to as one of the hardest in the series. Um, this is going to go one of two ways. It's either I am going to do well and we're going to have a good time, or this is going to just make me very, very salty. Because I'm the entire time I'm just going to be thinking, I, I know I can do better. So this one, it's... It's the origin story of this series. It's it's a little different. I owned uh, two growing up, but as a teenager, one day I was uh, very curious about the original game, and I played it, and wow, is it so much harder. But I think it's still fun. It's one of these games that just has that NES difficulty associated with it. And uh, I am playing this on hardware, so it's, it's not emulation. I'm using my childhood NES controller, which you know, is still in okay condition, but it has seen better days. Cartridge and everything. That's why I was like, hmm, hope this works. I didn't have to clean the cartridge, so we're good. But the series makes me happy just because, uh, yeah, music. It has some of the best music that the NES had to offer. I haven't died yet, so hey, that's a, that's a good sign. I do love that they got rid of the point system. <laughs> Immediately in the sequel. Just, yep, gone. Never to be seen again. But this was the era where I guess everything had a score. I don't know why. If I was to take a guess, it was just because most games, they weren't large in scope. They were kind of just arcade ports. I mean, even Mario, like, took a while for it to get rid of scores. Just look, look at look at some of, ah, look at some of the stuff you have to put up with. Oh my god, this asshole! I forgot. This this might kill me. Ugh. All right, it's fine. There's another one though. No, okay. I made it to the door first try. I'm probably gonna die. Um. Oh no, wait. Right, this is Mega Man one. Yeah. So this is a difference. Mega Man one. Um. You get to the door, it's not the boss, it's- there's a, like a little... little extra section. Wow. oh, yeah, okay. That is rare. It's not a Mega Man game unless you grind health for the boss. Okay, this is the one I have to grind here. Sorry! <laughs> Just, they have to resort to this. This might- this might cause more harm than good, but we'll see. Health was rarer, if I remember correctly. And, uh, later on, I guess we'll see how I feel. I may have to resort to cheese. Oh yeah, no, there's a very well-known cheese because one of the boss fights is, is just completely infamous in terms of how difficult it is. I could probably do it legit, it's just if it does get that frustrating, I, I, won't, I won't hesitate. Because that's going to mean the difference between a, like, nice, clean, maybe two-hour playthrough versus one that just goes for just way longer than it should. I mean, granted, I'm already grinding for shit, but, like, if I can hang on to my lives, I can do pretty well. Oh, you thought I was gonna eat cheese? Well, I do have cheese to eat, but I'm not gonna. I mean, I can't. I'm playing Mega Man. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I made it worse. Should I, just, I should just fight. The problem is I have to go through this again. Because if I die, I have to walk through this corridor again. I'm probably... All right, I got an extra life. Fuck it. The Deadly Cutsman! Damn it, forgot the boomerang. Alright. I tried. Yeah, yeah, good. I'm so glad I got rid of this in later ones. Alright, this is fine. Dick. Thought you were gonna jump. Oh, 
Got him. Gotcha! Ah! <laughs> Alright. There we go. That's fine. I honestly don't remember the order for this. I'm hoping I'm correct. <laughs> but this was the cool thing about it was if you knew, I mean eventually through mastery of the game, you would know which weapon to use and when. Because yeah, one's not one that I played a lot of. It's not as familiar as say two where like, yeah, I could, I could probably get through that game without dying. Ugh, I tried. This game baits you into trying to go back for health, but it's 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 a trap. Just keep going forward. Don't worry. <laughs> it wouldn't be a Mega Man game without this shit. All right, I'm ready. Yep, good. Dude. <laughs> Thank you. Worst, worst thing ever. <sighs> oh, yeah. Enemy spam. Right, I need guts, man. Yeah. That's fine. I can't remember if there's a way to come back into the stage once you're done with it. As long as I can make it to the boss without dying, I'll be happy. <sighs> Fuck this thing. I, I hate it. I hate it. Ugh. <laughs> it does so much damage. That is one thing they got rid of in later games, is just that thing. Yeah, good. No, yep, no, that's fair. When I go up the left side, take damage first. If I take too much damage, it's basically a lost cause when I get to the top. Nice! Alright, alright, alright. Things are looking good now. I can't remember for the life of me if this works. It doesn't. Unfortunately. Okay. That's the one. Got it. But at least I remembered going up the left side was correct, because if you may have noticed, there's, there's a wall there. And uh, if you don't have the gutsman power, then that's it. You gotta go back down. Yeah! <laughs> Fucking asshole. Oh, alright. Honestly, not the worst outcome. Let's... Fingers crossed I remembered correctly. Yeah. I remembered correctly. <laughs> Cause you see, you cut you cut power. You get it? You cut power? Yeah. That's how you remember. You cut the power! Um, and then I think the rest is kind of straightforward, if I remember correctly. Maybe. Yay, Ice Stage. I mean, this... This is not an NES game that was made, uh... In the 90s. This is like one of the ones from the 1980s, so... This had some of the best graphics at the time. This is a fucking game. It is. I figure if I'm gonna have... Mega Man 2 has a VOD, I, I guess I have to do the others. That's so far so good. For me, this one always goes one of two ways. Either I have a good time with it, and it works out, or like, suffering of the highest order. Damn it. I hate the disappearing block. Oh, shit, I messed it up. Got it. Mega Man 3 for Game Boy is your favorite. Oh, the personal nostalgia for the Game Boy one. For me, it's two. It's just... It's the one I owned on the NES, but also just the soundtrack to that. You just cannot go wrong with that one. I really have to jump on that first one. Oh no, it really, really is like that. Okay. 
What? Okay, so I can just hang out here by the looks of it, and then we just resolve it. Oh, oh wait, it despawned. Cool. Now I don't have to stress. Alright, no stress now. It despawned. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I don't want that happens. <laughs> Just shoves you to the side. Shit. Impatient. Come on, <laughs> so close. Alright, this is the one. Shit, I <laughs> got it again. Okay. Oh no. Ooh. Yeah, you know what's fucked about that is if you take hit, you fall through. So, just exactly what you saw there. I landed on the platform, but because I took damage, it put me through the platform. First try, hey. Now just... Pray to whatever higher be being you believe in that I'm not gonna... ...take damage as I f touch a platform. Don't you dare! This, this game is such an asshole. No, it, it just doesn't directly take you there. Did I fuck up? I may have fucked up. It just... Uh... Gah! Why wouldn't the platform go directly there? They don't follow a pattern. I think of all the stages, this is the one that I, I don't like. Yeah, you can, you, can, you can see why. You have to hit it. Otherwise, it just becomes nightmarish. <laughs> Please. May as well. Not that it matters. If I die here, it's game over anyway. This is so evil, man. Ugh, could have used the. Motherfucker! <laughs> just, just curious about something. Oh, crutch incoming! Ah, good. <laughs> All right. I have my crutch now. I can go back to the ice stage and be fine. Even if the platforms do behave like dicks, it's fine. I can, I can make it. All right. See now, I'm back up to where I was. Everything's all good. I was about to say, oh yeah, first try, look at that, look at how good I am. I fucked up. I'm just gonna shut up about this one. <laughs> I haven't learned a thing, have I? I, I absolutely hate this part. <laughs> it's just, you're at the mercy of RNG. It's just, they're either gonna be in a good position or they're just going to fuck you over like that. I'm in a- I'm in a bad spot here. <laughs> it's gone down. <laughs> Why did they not make these things follow a set path? It's just... <laughs> Fuck you! Ah! Ugh, I might just have to... 
use the crotch to get across it. I was gonna use it from the midpoint, but I think I just I just have to use the whole thing across. Okay, it is time for crutch. Fuck. <laughs> I have not used this in years. I needed to jump sooner. This is the only stage I'm gonna struggle with. The others I, I do generally okay. It's just this one. I've said this before, but as a child, I hated anything to do with ice. I hated anything to do with water. With a couple of exceptions, like Donkey Kong Country's water stages. Which the music carried those stages, to be honest. How can you be mad at a stage that has music like that? But just anything involving water or ice, it's it's just suffering. Don't go to Scandinavia, but that's real life. It's not, it's not a game. I've experienced snow, you know that, right? Just not to the same extent. Motherfucker! <laughs> I need to pay attention to what I'm doing. Okay. I gotta stop swearing as well. Think of the children! I'm going to try it once without the crutch. Just once, please. Oh, I was so worried where that was going. Okay. No, this is this is a bag of dick. Oh god, I forgot how this works. Okay, that's fine. Just run towards freedom. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, there you go. Nothing to it. And this is why this is so important because. It helps against this asshole. I'm pretty confident I'll be fine here. <laughs> when you consider what I had to go through... Man. Just a little anticlimactic, huh?